Okay. Well, okay, I'm over like 32 years on board out here selling kites. Tell us your name. My name is Floyd Glasgow. What up, Raph Leaders? Welcome back to my channel. It's Easter Monday in Georgetown, Guyana, and today we're going to take a look at what's happening on Regent Street in Georgetown. We're going to take a look at the kites that are for sale, and then we'll take a look at the flying experience in the National Park. So stay tuned. This is my, this is my, this is my day. I'm ready to take it on, come what may. So this is Border, Mayor Border Market. That's the post office. And this is a kite stand where the traditional Guyanese kites are on display. So these are wooden kites or wood kites with paper. They're made locally. sizes and they're sold complete with uh, string ball and string you sell TL2 right yeah you want to tell us a little bit about the kites how much That's for them fine, man. how much for the kites this is a kite the kites is a thousand man a thousand so that's yeah. five dollars US yeah so what are the it larger do, larger it, ones are going depends, for depends on the price on the size? Yeah, the size. So what's the price of the largest ones? The largest size. That's only for 5,000. 5,000, mm -hmm. which is about 25 US. Go! Yeah. So you want to tell us your name and how to connect, how to contact you? My name, my name is Kenneth Joseph. Kenneth Joseph, you have like a, tel a telephone number or something that people can find you? Hello. 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 All right, no problem. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Get on. So this is what the kite operation looks like here in Georgetown. It's Easter Monday, it's a national holiday, and the kites are on sale from $1,000 to $5,000, and they're all over the city. They're made locally, and they're complete. You can buy a complete setup. So as we walk, walk along Regent Street, you can see we're opposite border market, border is closed and there are kites on cement everywhere but as you walk along Regent Street what we encounter is these kites that are on the fence and on display what's the price of the kites? From a thousand so tell us your name and how much uh, how they can contact you Teresi Laz yeah yeah but these are people from all over the world right this is right. on the internet so yeah. they don't really care if it's Guyana if it's next year yeah or next year no they will contact you and buy you buy yeah. a kite anytime you don't have to fly kite anymore. so just tell us you have a contact number yeah. or something yeah. internet show your phone internet yeah yeah man show I'm, you, I'm giving your you an international Before. audience so that people yeah, can send your number here yeah. right so people who watch this channel are from New York or from London or from Toronto and they don't care it's Easter they just like the fact that they can buy a souvenir right they want something that they can keep and say this is Guyanese so if they come to the Guyana they want to be able to contact you and buy a kite any time of the year but well, okay I'm over like 32 years on board out here selling kites tell us your name my name is Floyd Glasgow I'm Floyd the Glasgow yeah I'm the original board kite man okay so when you come into border and you're looking for a kite the people that say, yeah, you can go to Rastaman and get a kite, but it's not any Rastaman. You look for the Rastaman with the Douglas woman, okay. right, and you look for the star pipe. So tell us how Just much... very close to the post office. Tell us how much the kites are going to sell them for. Well, we have various price, so right? So I will convert them to US. You tell me the price in Guyana dollars. Convert it to US, and we do it in, in Guyana dollars. Right. Convert it Guyana, 15, 15, 100. Complete, 21. 1500 US dollars. 1500 Guyana dollars. 1500 Guyana dollars. For the kite. Ball yeah. and tail complete 2100. 20 Guyana dollars. Alright, so that's 10 dollars US. Going down. Yeah. 1000 Guyana dollars. That's 5 dollars US. Ball and tail 1600. Alright, that is 14. That's 13 dollars US. And we have the. We just find out. Okay. And we have the regular 20 inch. 20 inches. What's the right. price? This complete, 1800 1800 that's $1,200. $1,200 dollars with $1,800 complete. complete. So $1,200 is $6 US, $1,800 is $9 US. Good, and we move to the two and a half. That's the bigger kite. This is $2,500. $2,500. Two out of five complete. 
$12.50 US or $15, $17 US. And that's it? Yes. Sorry, tell us your name again. Floyd Glasgow. Floyd Glasgow and you can contact him here at Border. When it's not Easter, can they find you? When it's yeah, not on, Easter? On 223 4290. 223 4290. 694 3281. 694 3281. You can get me on those numbers. Floyd, meet him here in Guyana when you come. If you're looking for souvenirs, Kai souvenirs to take back to the US, to Canada, to the UK, find him here at Border, find him on his numbers. Thank you. Thank you. Save them. Good, thanks. Some more kites. Ready, kites? Yeah. How much are these? Yeah. These are bird kites? Yeah. How much is the bird kites? 300 for one. 300 dollars for the bird kites. Nice price. Okay. That's about a dollar fifty US. However, I ain't got I ain't got cash up here right now, sorry. But you can get bird kites, these are Chinese made, right? Yeah, Chinese I know. Yeah. yeah, these were invented by Chinese, so you can also get Chinese made bird kites here in Georgetown, but this is a Guyanese made. Star Point kites here in Georgetown, Guyana. The border market is still open. And Regent Street is still busy. I used to fly kites when I was a kid. Something I look forward to. We would fly these kites from months before Easter, from February. We'd be flying, making and flying kites. From February all until, uh, until until May or June, right? Because it wasn't enough for us to fly just on Easter Monday or just on the Easter weekend. You know, when you're a kid, you want the, the fun to last as long as possible. So we would fly kites from two months before Easter until two months after Easter. And in our case, some of our kites would stay up. For weeks, you know, there's a kind of kite that you can make that you can fly, can stay aloft for weeks because the wind is, it is so windy in Guyana that, that your kite never has to come down. So these are some more guys, these kites. Uh -huh. Tell us, tell us about the kites, what's the price of the kites? Kite? Yes. Different Bridges. price, 1500 with everything. 2000 with everything. With everything, 1500 yeah, just know. Yeah, $5.50 US. You like to have a few? Now let me see, I'm, I'm showing the Guyanese living in Canada and in the US and in England what Easter Monday looks like. Okay. Most of these people don't live here, but when they come to Guyana, they want to buy a souvenir. So they would come and they would buy kites to take back to the US and to Canada, right? So what I'm trying to do, to get them to see what the kite scene is and who they should ask they should contact because maybe they don't come at Easter time they come when it's not Easter but they still want to buy a kite for a souvenir okay. okay so these are the people I'm catering for so if you can tell me like how to contact you okay well I have the number the marketing exactly international market not just in just the global market, market, right? global market. Well, the whole world must know that kite, kites are very important in Guyana this is unique we are the only yeah. country in the world that makes kites like this yeah. exactly yeah, you know. so you can buy a kite and take it back as a souvenir it doesn't have to be Easter right, right. So that's and what I'm trying to say and then when it's Easter time they could decide well I could order from this guy in Guyana yeah, exactly and you can fly it in New York or Toronto or wherever you are yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so yeah, if you yeah, give well, me your contact yeah, information yeah well the number is six 90. 690. 0294. 0294. What's the name? Andre. Name is Andre. So come look for Andre. 690 0294. If you want to buy a souvenir, take it back with you. Thank you. Yeah. So these are some more, the larger kites. You want to tell us about your kites? Huh? Want to tell us something about the kites? Uh, How much for the price? Other prices? Reasonable. Twelve. 
Eight, six. Which ones are the 12, 1200? This is 1200. So these are 1200? Yeah. 600, 600, 800. 800. Yeah. Do you have like contact information you want to tell? So I have a channel that uh, caters to people living in New York and Toronto and London and so on. So what I want to show them what's happening here at Easter Monday. But these people come to Guyana and they buy souvenirs. So this is not necessarily kite to fly. This is kite that they can buy to take back with them. Okay. So if you can tell me how to find you, then your kite. Yeah. Right. So if you can tell me how to find you, yeah. then I can tell people when they come to Guyana to look for you to buy kites and souvenir to take back. Yeah. Tell me your name. My name is Joel. Joel Drayton. Joel Drayton. How they can yeah. contact you? They can contact me on Facebook. On say, Facebook. Good. Yeah. That's very good. So give a jo Facebook. Joel Drayton. Joel Drayton. Yeah. On Facebook. On Facebook. And cell phone number is six zero two five seven fifty. 5715, 6025 5715. So contact yeah. Gerald? Joel. Joel Drayton. When you come to Guyana and you want to take back some souvenirs, some kite souvenirs, nice kites. these are Guyanese made, these are unique to Guyana. They're not made anywhere else in the world. Okay. Contact Joel and he will hook you up with kites to take back to the US, to Canada, and to the UK. Thanks, guys. Yeah, yeah. no problem. Thank you. So these are Chinese made bird kites, three hundred dollars. I don't have any cash on me right now, but I'm gonna to go to the bank and come back. Okay, you have them. So there are very various pictures, designs on them. Yes. For the kids, yeah, these are the Chinese made kites. Yes. All right, thank you. Guys, that's Easter Monday on Regent Street in Georgetown, Guyana. If you want to see more comments, like this, like and subscribe. And in the comments below, tell me what you think about Easter Monday in Guyana. You have Easter Monday traditions where you are. It's a national holiday like it is in Guyana. And remember, do support this channel on Patreon and on PayPal. Share this video with friends and family around the world. And enjoy the holiday as usual. We'll see you again next time. Later.